new program looks to identify safe spaces for San Diegans in the LGBTQ community if they become victims of hate crimes or need to report suspicious activity. This safe place program is being launched as a partnership between San Diego police and local LGBTQ businesses. News 8's Heather Hope reports. Carlo, Heather, yes, Urban Mose is one of many places with stickers like these in front of them, marking them as a safe place from hate. Once it has this designation, it becomes a safe refuge from people who need to report hate crimes or need resources. This, we know, is important at an incredible time in our community. San Diego leaders partnering with police and businesses to mark places safe from hate. The LGBT community continues to be regularly targeted. In comes the Safe Place Program, the initiative to help San Diegans clearly identify businesses that are safe places for victims of a hate crime or how to report suspicious activity. Far too often, victims of hate feel afraid or uncomfortable in contacting the police. Up first, Chris Shaw of Urban Mose on University in the heart of Hillcrest puts the Safe Place sticker on his front window. I'm truly really honored to be the first business. Urban Mose is honored to be the first business to post the Safe Place uh, decal. It's not your average sticker. It includes a QR code where anyone can scan for more information on hate crimes and how to report them. We're going to ask the businesses to put these uh, safe place signs in their windows if they are a safe place, and I'm sure they all will agree, to let people come in and know that they are safe there. San Diego isn't the first city to have the safe place program. It models a uh, sticker that has been uh, developed by other police departments around the nation. Um, but I wanted to expand on that. SDPD has new procedures being developed now for how officers will use visual and verbal cues to become more aware of an individual's gender identity. This also ensures our bookings, our pat-downs, and our searches are performed in accordance with their preferred gender. Some commented on how policing in the community has come a long way. Let me tell you from a Latino LGBT activist for now over half a century, this is indeed progress and change in San Diego. San Diego Mayor Todd Gloria says San Diego will not be a place for hate. It is our collective responsibility to make sure that our friends and our neighbors are safe. And so we're calling upon San Diegans as business owners to participate in this program. As the list of businesses grows to have stickers like these placed in front of their windows, we have on our website at cbs8.com how the city now has more information about its program if you'd like to become a part of it.